It's time to set a new course. Aye, aye, Captain. Spencer needs a delivery of rum. I've been sent to get it. Times must be hard if you're working for that old git. No pirate hides in a hideout without rum. <laughs> Might use that as a slogan. Where do I load the rum? Load it on my ship. I'll take care of the rest. Will do. You tell Spencer to keep up the habit. I have a shipment for you from Takarigua. Really? That's wonderful. Here's 1,000 gold. You know we can start by spending it on? A better joke book for you. I meant a drink. Here, you'll like this. Where can you find a pirate who's lost both his wooden legs? Exactly where you left him. <coughs> Perhaps there's a way we can help each other. After all, I do hate to see a lady in distress. Keep talking, I'm listening. Well, it's about our mutual friend Wilson. I like the sound of this. 500 gold, and we're in business. Suits me. Here's your gold. You'd better be off and see Wilson. Tell him I'll be there in a moment. But I've got a reputation to protect. Not a word about this to anyone, you promise? Gentleman's honor. Gentlemen, don't make me laugh. Little Bird tells me you've got a soft spot for Grace. What? Who said so? Is it true? Since you ask, I'm not without affection for the lady in question. That plus you want to jump her bones, right? I spoke to Grace about you. You did? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What did she say? She wants to meet you. She does? But that's... That's incredible! How the hell did you do it? No, 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 I don't want to know. I'd best go put on my pudding pants, Sled. Yeah, I'll give that old sheath of mine a good rinse out. I'd have some of them rhino horn pills left and all. Leave it out. You. Yes, you. What is it? Keep it down, eh? Got something special here. You interested? What are you skulking around here for? The things I got, they're not for everyone. Have to be careful who I deal with, see? But you look like the kind of man I can trust. The kind who knows the value of a good deal. The kind of stuff you can't get anywhere else. Some of them extra special, just for the best captains. You name it, I can get it for you. And always at a reasonable price. Right, so you're some kind of con man. And you think I'm gonna fall for this crap? Hear me out, Squire. Where did you get all this stuff from? Ah, that's my business. Do I ask you where you got all your gear from? A lot of it from people I killed. Do I look that stupid to you? You want me to buy something without knowing what it is? Okay, so I'll tell you. It's a key from the tavern. Belonged to Spencer the landlord. Get you into any of the rooms they used to rent out to travelers. And look here. A treasure map too. All kosher. 100% guaranteed genuine. <laughs> Pleasure doing business, Squire. It'll be worth it, I promise you. All it and worth it. We're all pretty much fucked, I reckon. Right. I reckon you're right. Some kind of journal. Let's see. Fortune never favored me with an heir, and I am still undefeated in dueling. So I will hide the legendary secret of my success in my father's grave and go into exile. May it one day be found by a worthy successor, 
And here he's marked grave with the name Gibson. I'll make a note of that. Got something for you. There's supposed to be treasure buried at the end of the beach in the west. Really? What? Brilliant. That's exactly what I needed to know. I better hurry before some other chancer finds it. What's the deal with my powder cakes? I'll have them brought to the quayside right away. Finally. Feel like talking? If you like. Pirate captain to pirate captain, you know what I mean? Got a taste for the buccaneering life, have you? I've had worse jobs. Yes? Like what? Sorry, I can't say. I suppose you must have your reasons. Some other time, perhaps. My story's simpler. I was barely out of short trousers when Alvarez took me under his wing. A life on the ocean wave, free from women and home and duty. That's what I wanted. 
better a short life at sea than a long one on land. Alvarez was your mentor, then? You might say that. He's not changed one bit. Still banging on about his precious creed. Still stuck in the past. How did you get your ship? I took her the way I'd take any woman. By force. Triggered by growing outrage. Levels of violence again are among the highest in the world. We need men to be uh, leading the way. Do we? Apparently, yes. <laughs> Nothing more to tell.